Hello, so today I just want to share with you my empties for February of 2023. I have a whole stack of them here. I did get myself a new bucket, so that's nice. It's a lot bigger than the other one. Because the other one I had to like play Tetris to get everything to fit in there. So this one, just throw it all in there and it's it's good to go. So I'm just going to grab and go from there. First off, we finished a hand soap in champagne, apple, and honey. Scent notes are Pink Lady Apple, Sparkling Champagne, and Autumn Woods. I absolutely love the scent. It's definitely one of my favorite scents. Apple scents are just out of this world, in my opinion. They're so fresh and clean. I just love them. Next, I finished up a hand soap in Pumpkin Apple. Scent notes are Red Delicious Apples, Fall Pumpkin, and Clove Buds. So this one is so strong. I don't know if I would repurchase this one. I might have more. I can't really remember what I have under my sink. But in the future, I wouldn't buy this one again. It's just really strong. You remember they brought out the body care and like the minis? I bought two hand creams in it. I used one and I threw the other one away, which is crazy because I never throw anything away. But I just couldn't bring myself to use another one. Like this is definitely a scent that is best for like home fragrance. I'm still not sure how I feel about it in the soap. Like, it's just too strong. I used up a Tree Hut scrub in Papaya Paradise. I absolutely love this one. It's so sweet and it's so strong. It's definitely one of my favorites. I just picked up a couple more of these from Target. I also used up a Frosted Cranberry from Tree Hut. This was their one of their Christmas ones. I think I have one more of these. I actually really like this scent. It's the Sweet Cranberry. Kind of reminds me of Winterberry Wonder. Because sometimes cranberries are really tart. But this scent's actually pretty sweet. It's nice. Also from Tree Hat, I finished up a green tea. Which is one of my other favorite scents. This is just like a sweet, clean scent. So whenever I see this, I buy it. The only place I really see it anymore, though, is Ulta. And Ulta prices on Tree Hut are quite a bit higher than Target. I think they're like $8 at Target, and they're like $10.50 at Ulta. So definitely not the best place to buy them. Finished up a moisturizing body wash in Bonfire Bash. The notes are vanilla bourbon, creamy sandalwood, and cashmere musk. I love this one. Finished up a set in Autumn Drive, which is Wild Raspberries, Warm Amber, and Vanilla Birch. Definitely one of my favorites. Such a good raspberry scent. There's the lotion right here. Finish that up. I used up a Bubblegum Pop. Sit notes are Gumball Sugar, Candied Fruits, and Citrus Burst. This scent's so fun. I just love it. Every time I use it, it just makes me happy. And since that didn't have a lotion that came out with it, I used it with this. Pink Watermelon Blast, which has scent notes of juicy pink watermelon, sugared strawberry blossoms, and lime zest. This is such a good scent. It smells like watermelon candy. I used up a set of Summer Melody, which is just what Golden Honeydew and Bronze Vanilla. Here's the spray right here. So I have to say that the lotion doesn't smell as good as the spray. Like, it still smells good. It's just not as nice as the spray. I used up a scrub in A Thousand Wishes. This is Pink Prosecco, Sparkling Keints, Crystal Peonies, Gilded Amber, and Amaretto Creme. I love A Thousand Wishes, but this is a glowing body scrub. I just don't like these. I got this at SAS. I think I have one more, but I wouldn't buy this one again for sure. So thank you. I used up a set of Poppy, which is Fresh Morning Dew, Wild Poppies, Sugared Rhubarb, and Juicy Pear. This is such a nice, light, like, spring scent. It's really nice. It's like a sweet floral. It's a really good scent. Used up a bar soap and cucumber melon. I actually really like this in the bar soap. I can't stand it in the body care just because it was like the scent of the 90s and I wore it so much in the 90s that I'm just not interested in the body care. I bought a set for nostalgia a few years ago and I used it up and I'm just like never again. So 
Some things need to stay in the past, but in the bar soap, it's really nice. I used up a body wash and bubble gum pop. Here's the notes again. I read them earlier. Gumball sugar, candy fruit, citrus burst. I really like it in the shower gel. I used up another spray of bubble gum pop. And this time I paired it with cotton candy clouds, which is sponge sugar, pink berries, and whipped vanilla. So I definitely like the pairing of the watermelon better than this one. This one was just like too sugary, if that makes sense. Like it was just, I don't know, it didn't mesh as well together as I would hoped it would. I used up a soap in Autumn S'mores, which is crisp apple, gooey marshmallow, and cinnamon spice. I really like this one. It's like a gourmand ball scent. It's good. I used up this body butter in Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte. I am definitely happy that this is gone. I feel like I've been using this forever. The Marshmallow Pumpkin Latte is not my favorite scent, but finally done with it, so moving on. Used up another Tree Hut scrub in Velvet Coffee. This was my last one of this, and I'm so happy it's gone. I cannot stand this scent. Like, I love coffee scents, but this one just misses the mark. Like, there is something extra in here. I guess it's the velvet. I don't know, but it's just, it's awful. It just smells terrible, in my opinion. Used up a set of Enchanted Candy Potion, which is... Spellbinding Sugar, Bewitched Berries, and Whipped Pixie Dust. And here's the body cream. I have to say that the body cream does not smell at all as good as the spray. It has like a weird smell to it. I don't particularly like it. I like the spray though. I used up a scrub in Poppy. This is a creamy body scrub. These are ones I really like. Fresh Morning Dew, Wild Poppy, Sugar Rhubarb, Juicy Pear. I love this one. Used up a set from Victoria's Secret with the Mango Temptation, which is Mango Nectar, Hibiscus Flower, and Paradise Found, whatever that is. And here's the spray right here. So I've been trying to use up all my Victoria's Secret stuff because I cannot stand their lotions. Like, their lotions are trash, in my opinion. Like, they're so thin and, like, watery and they don't moisturize. They smell amazing, though. I have to say, they have better scent than Bath & Body Works lotions, but they just don't moisturize. So I've been trying to get, I'm going to start trying to get through all the ones that I have. So you'll start seeing them more in my empties. I used up another set from Victoria's Secret. This is Pure Seduction La Creme, which has scent notes of Caramel Apple, Soft Gardenia, and Creme de la Pure Seduction. This smells like champagne toast. Like, why does this smell like champagne toast? There's no, I don't smell any apple, I don't smell any gardenia. It smells like champagne toast. It was just, it was really weird. I don't know why it smells like that. Here's the lotion right here. So I'm glad that's in my collection. I used up this moisturizing hand sanitizer and strawberry pound cake. This was in my car and it took me like four months to go through this. Right now I'm working on a champagne apple with honey. So you'll probably see that in like July. <laughs> like seriously, these take forever for me to go through. I used up a set of Sunset Glow. I love this scent which is crushed coconut, sparkling cherry, seltzer, dreamy moonflower, and caramelized vanilla. This is such a pretty scent, and the packaging is so beautiful. Here's the spray. Like, it's just so nice. I love this scent. Used up a set of white pumpkin and chai, which is cinnamon cider, spiced pumpkin, and vanilla glaze. My favorite gourmand fall scent used up a shower gel in Pretty as a Peach, which is Blushing Peach, Jasmine Petals, White Nectarine, Apple Blossom, and Sheer Freesia. It's a really nice peach scent. I used up a set of Strawberry Pound Cake, which is my favorite. It has scent notes of, if you can focus, there we go, Fresh Strawberries, Golden Shortcake, and Whipped Cream. So here's the body cream. I also used up a shower gel. Used up a bar soap and cucumber and lily. It's a nice scent. Just smells like soap. 
You can imagine that, right? Used up a moisturizing body wash and vanilla bean as well, which is fresh vanilla bean, warm caramel, sugar cookies, whipped cream, snow kiss musk. I really do like vanilla bean no well, but it is very, very light as usual. Used up a scrub in gingham, which is blue freesia, white peach, fresh clementine, violet, clean musk. I really like gingham. Just a nice clean scent. Used up hand soap in island pop. Papaya. The notes are tropical coconut, fresh papaya, and sugar cane. This one was nice. I don't know if it was memorable, but it was okay. I used up a set of Whitberry Meringue, which is fresh berries, whipped sugar, and fluffy vanilla. So this just is like boardwalk taffy, cotton candy clouds, that same sugary type of scent. I used up a set of sweet whiskey. Golden Amber, Vanilla Infused Whiskey, Sweet Red Berries. I love this scent. It's basically like Bonfire Bash with berries. It's so strong. Such a good scent. There's the spray. Roll those up. I used up a set of Pinkberry Clouds, which is a Strawberry Sponge Sugar, Marshmallow Fluff, and Fresh Air. There's the spray. Finish both of those up. It's a nice scent. It's kind of like cotton candy clouds but it has that fresh air note which i don't really know what that fresh air note is but you can definitely smell it i used up a soap and coconut mint drop i love this scent it has set notes of white coconut ice peppermint and winter musk this is a great scent in the body care which i hope they bring back this winter and then it's also amazing in the soap i used up a shower gel in cinnamon donut swirl set notes of Sweet cinnamon, brown sugar, and fluffy dough. So this smells like it has berries in it. Like, they're not in the scent notes, but I can smell them in there. There's, like, a definitely a berry type of note in this. I used up a shower gel in Paris Amour. It's an oldie, for sure. It has French tulips, apple blossoms, and sparkling pink champagne, touched with sandalwood and creamy musk. So this is just a really pretty sweet kind of floral scent this is old it's from 2018 i believe yeah 2018 right there it's only 12 it was 1250 i think that. <laughs> i used up a moisturizing body wash in poppy definitely a good one this one in summer melody I use one in the sunset glow so it's definitely more cherry scented in the body wash than in the body care but i still really like it for sanitizers i used up a spray in mango mai tai i used up a spray in kiwi strawberry let's see pocket backs i used up a cotton candy clouds Summer Melody, Strawberry Lemon. I love the way this one smells. I'm sure this one's expired. It's just from 2019, I think. But I couldn't let it go. And then I used up one in Watermelon Lemonade. So for room sprays, I used up a Georgia Peach. This is really nice, a sweet peach scent. I used up a Mahogany Coconut. This one was okay. It's my favorite. I used up a pink watermelon, and then I also used up a strawberry pound cake. Love strawberry pound cake. And I used up three of these sugared watermelons. I went crazy on this scent when it came out. This is basically pink watermelon, but the first version. So it's just that sweet watermelon scent. It's such a good one. I think I bought... I don't even know how many of these I bought, but I have nine left out of, I think I only have like 15 room sprays left and like nine of them are this. So you'll definitely see a bunch of these. I used up three of these this month. See, <laughs> I'm proud of myself though. I'm down to like 15 room sprays. I think that's amazing. I used up one perfume this month, which is Summer Melody. Don't want to focus on it. I really wish they would have brought this out in a big size. For lippies, I used up 
a Mary cookie. That one was okay. I used up a mango. I used up peppermint patty. I love this one. This is such a good one. That mint chocolate. And then, of course, my favorite. I use every day is my favorite night balm. And then for hand creams, we used up a Summer Melody, Buttercup Cymbalini. Oh, things are falling. A Thousand Wishes, Strawberry Pound Cake. This is one of those whipped ones. I think I have one more of these and I'm using it this next month. Finally going to be done with those. And the last one I used up is Happy Easter Sweet Bunny Berry. So that is all my empties for February of 2023. I think I've done a really good job of using up some stuff. I'm finally starting to see a little bit of a dent. But I definitely want to make more of a dent. My ultimate goal is to basically use up most of my collection and then just buy for the season. So we'll see how that goes. I've done a good job of not buying the things that I said I wasn't going to buy. No candles, no soaps, no room sprays, no wallflowers. I'm actually down to like four wallflowers and so excited that those are almost gone. You know, no lippies, no minis. And it, you know, the more you pull away from Bath and Body Works, the easier it gets to avoid Bath and Body Works. Like I used to check the site like almost every day, but like I don't do that anymore. So I feel like I'm making good progress. I hope you guys used up a bunch of your stuff this month and you're getting through your things. Let me know. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.